Yeah, I mean, Rob, you said that Kamala Harris was the most far left radical to yeah. ever run for president. Now with Waltz in there, they are the most far left radical ticket in the history of American politics. There is no doubt about it. You just went through a litany of the issues with this guy. And I think every American needs to pay very close attention to this, because if these two get a hold of our country, you thought it was bad under oh, Joe God. Biden. Think about the same policies that Biden and Harris have implemented, but on steroids, because the difference is while Joe Biden has been this empty vessel who they've kind of manipulated and maneuvered around, Kamala Harris has bought in yeah. to these ideas and is actually more radical in so many ways, along with Governor Walsh. So don't make a mistake about this, ladies and gentlemen. This is the future of America. It looks like Minneapolis during the summer of love riots. Yeah. Pay attention to what's going on. And I guess, yeah, you could look at it as a gift. I hope that the Jewish American population has seen what Kamala Harris did here. To your point, you had a Jewish man having to denounce his pro-Israel views in order to then get snubbed get because snubbed. they had to go for a guy who would play to the radicals yeah. in the base of their party. The whole thing is crazy. Yeah. The fact that we are here 16 days after Kamala Harris was coronated, Tim Walz is her running mate. Uh, just get ready for yeah. the DNC, ladies and gentlemen, because uh, this is going to be a wild ride. And I can't wait until Donald Trump wins on November 5th so yeah. that we can put it into this craziness.